All right, so let's get into it with the Shift uh, 2.0 update here. So I've gone ahead and updated the client. Um, there's, uh, as you can see, I have several uh, email accounts already in here. Now I'm not gonna show you all of my emails, but what I want to show you is that you can add accounts. All right, so you can do the same as before, Gmail, uh, Inbox, uh, which is Gmail, Outlook, Mailbox, and Office 365, and I just realized I'm probably covering this up, so let me get myself shrunk down there. All right, so that's all of that right there, but also you can add an application. Okay, so this is where it gets interesting. So I'm not you guys can read, so I'll leave this up to you. You can pause it. Um, but AWS, there's some really interesting things here, the big ones here that I really liked. Uh, Facebook Business for uh, logging into pages, I would imagine. Uh, Evernote, a native Evernote app, uh, Dropbox, and then Trello, uh, really cool. So and obviously Slack. So for those of us who um, are you know building our businesses, doing things like that, uh, a lot of these apps are going to be pretty critical. I don't think I know anybody who doesn't use at least like two or three of these. Uh, and then outside of this, there's some people who probably use more of these, like uh, Asana for project management. Um, you know, if you're doing software development, there's some other cool uh, tie-ins in here. Uh, if you're a big, heavy Facebook user, Messenger is now included. All right, and that's uh, pretty, pretty good start, I think. And then they have said in their emails as well as on the uh, uh, review page that they're going to be adding more apps here. Okay, and you can see if you've got any installed. Um, and then let's see extensions. They're starting off with two. So this is for uh, Gmail right now, or it's I believe it's Chrome extensions. So Grammarly and Boomerang. Okay, and if you don't know what these are, then it may not be uh, super important to you. But Grammarly is nice. Makes sure everything you type is um, written correctly. Things like that. Boomerang uh, lets you send later. Do a lot of things like that in Gmail. And this is the big update, okay, but this definitely comes with a, a literal price. Uh, so their uh, pro plan used to be, I believe it was $19.99 or $20 bucks, um, a year. Uh, I've been paying for it myself. I like it. I've been using Shift. Uh, they've done this update, and now to use the apps, though, I believe it's called an advanced account. I may have the wording slightly wrong, uh, but it's going to be an additional fee, so it's a little bit higher than that. Uh, I believe they have a discount going out. I'll, I'll try to post it below. Um, but I think the recurring is going to be around a hundred dollars uh, And again, it's one of those where you hear the number and you're like man like that's what I first thought and I was like that's way too much uh, Which is kind of funny because if you get something that actually helps you and it saves you a few hours a month Then I mean this is unbelievable in terms of its actual value to you that said I, I'm not saying you know go use this if you don't think it's gonna be useful to you I just, it's funny to myself that I had that same response that I'm just like, a oh, hundred bucks a year, that's crazy. And then taking a step back and like taking a breath and just being like, wait a second, if I actually use this, then it's going to end up saving me time. And if it does that, then it's worthwhile. So I'll have to wait and see, to be honest, I'm not sure. Uh, I might do a trial and check it out and see how good the integrations are. And I do like that they are actively developing. I believe this came out just like a year ago and they've already got this going and they're going to be adding... Uh, more extensions and more apps. So that's it for now. Uh, we'll have something updated here along the, the lines as we go. If you have any questions about how this works or any questions about Shift uh, or any of the alternatives like, um, I'm trying to think of the other ones, there's uh, Wavebox and a couple others. So leave me a comment and uh, let me know what you think.